you can kind of flavor it with the Old Bay like you see fit. I use a little bit more than two table teaspoons, but it's up to you. And one capful or one half a teaspoon of lemon juice. And you can just slowly stir it. You can cook this three different types of ways. You can pan fry it with a little bit of oil. You can bake it. Or you can put it in your air fryer. Either way, it's really, really good. Your mix should look like that. See how it looks kind of like crab cakes? And when you form them into a patty, they'll look like this. And when they're done, they'll look like this. See? Pretty good. And you can pair this with a salad. You can pair this with... A dipping sauce. It really is it, it's really endless things that you can do with this. And you can eat it on a bun. It's super low calorie. And it's really, really good. And if you want to just make a crab salad, then you don't add the breadcrumbs. And you can put that on top of any salad, crackers. It's just a really versatile dish. So before I leave today, I wanted to talk about non-scale victories non-scale victories are, are those favorite pants that you used to could fit they're just starting to fit that's a non-scale victory your a1c went down or your blood pressure went down that's a non-scale victory and and those should those should be celebrated too i do have a tip so if you're like me sometimes i like to eat while i'm cooking and i become full or if i wind up overeating so you can just get you a healthy snack, some nuts or something while you're eating. And that's all I have for today. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. I love you guys. Like, subscribe, and comment if you like this recipe. And remember, eat good with good eats.